First, it was your eyes, then your smile, your laugh. We never stayed inside. You loved the sunlight hidden behind the broken trees. We had our own spot. We agreed to meet here again. We never stopped talking. You helped me through the hardest times. Your brother shining the sweetest of supportive smiles. Everyone knew we belonged. You rescued me in a sea of safety. With you, nothing felt like something. The leaves were more colorful in the fall. The sun was blinding to our old souls and dark hearts. I asked for your sweatshirt. You said yes. It grew warmer when reality grew distant. It was perfect. You were perfect. A never-ending cycle of contentment. However, one day, the glare from my computer screen became too strong. I realized I wanted something less. Your love was too heavy to carry, so I let go. Right after I did, my heart rose with guilt. I shouldn't have taken that leap of faith that I didn't need you. The truth is, I needed you more than the oxygen in my lungs. Our souls grew young. I didn't miss you. A lie. You hated me. The truth. We created a creature called love. In its image was beauty. However, its bite was fatal to the touch. You became evil. And our love died. It would never have a funeral. Therefore, its spirit haunts me with memories in search for a place to rest. I move through my days scared to turn back and remember our creature called love. I haven't seen her in a while, this new attraction to your love life. It's like you did it on purpose. The best of me was you, not anymore. Now this new girl of yours holds the best in you. If there's any left, you have created a new creature called, called, I don't know its name, but I do know it's not love. Finally, after all this time, I can breathe.